you know uh, there's this thing i want to talk about and it's about why would people why would you get married if you know you don't love that person you want their money you know honestly don't say white people hate us white people don't hate us we make them hate us because there is no way a man who divorces his wife come get married to you there's no way a man who was single and he fell in love with you you made him fall in love with you and then particularly for you if you're African girl you are not interested in his love you are not interested in his money he was older than you 10 20 30 or 10 years because there's a difference between those girls or those women who love older men and uh, these women who love young men. So it's a bit different. It's a different because people are different. So for me, I love older guys and I cannot wish to have any young guy there. That's me and I'm sorry to tell you and to disappoint you. Don't follow my example because you may end up <laughs> divorced in one year or two years it's up to you but for me i understand how to how to handle my husband but there is no marriage which is um, there's a marriage which is paradise listen oh you those who want to get divorced and get new men listen there's no paradise and that guy you are getting married to or the one who you, you get divorced to or getting married to another one it doesn't mean the new guy is better than the good one. You'll be more level than the one you have. <laughs> you have more ones than the other one. And then you realize he was not the one. <laughs> then you divorce him again. You go to another one. And then you date like 10 men. Even you can't get married anymore. Listen, men are not bad. Men are like kids. You handle them. You stay with them. You refuse to handle them. Get to another man. Get divorced and get to marry another woman. Another man. Like this, especially those girls who I've seen. I've seen many who have divorced since I got married. My marriage is not paradise. My marriage is not perfect. But I want to stick to my, <laughs> my husband because there's no man, there's no good man out there. This man has brought me out to Why should I have other, other, other things, other things, other excuses to live in? All those young guys, all those other men who are, who are trying to show off that they can make a word for you. Oh, they want to travel with you. Listen, that's not how life goes. That man you are with you, that, I promise you, you'll not be the last one. That is the second one. You remove to fourth and fifth, and then you'll be single forever. <laughs> and that's it. That's how life is. Understand? You come to realize like this thing was the truth when she said, "Stick to the man who married you." That's it. No other question. No other thing. That's how it is. It's kind of rainy right now. So. All I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, you have to be intelligent. Who else that says? The woman, the woman is the one who the relationship or the marriage, and the woman is the one who destroyed. And if you didn't try, and if you're Christian and you're doing these things, oh, we cannot be there. I don't have you anymore. Uh, we cannot understand you. Uh, oh, we cannot stand you together. Uh, we cannot <laughs> Like I said, my marriage is not perfect. It's not a good thing. But I learned to promote it. Yeah. I learned from those who are still in love in their marriage. And they give their advice. So that's why I'm keeping it fine. And other things.
Oh. Apart from that, <laughs> I keep God first. <laughs> I can't give my marriage without God, okay? So with God, then I keep my marriage. That always happens. That's how it goes. That's how it happens. And that's it. And that is. That's how it is. I keep God first. And then the rest. The rest is God knows. <laughs> so I don't want to look for another man. When I know God is the source of my happiness. God is the source of my everything I need. God is who made me to be who I am. So if you want to keep your marriage, keep God first. And try not to listen to other people's things. And don't try to be somebody that doesn't help. So I, I leave you with that. So I hope you run by that one point.